In the vast tapestry of life on our planet, there are few creatures that capture the imagination quite like the Komodo dragon. Some creatures seem to have stepped directly from prehistory, and the Komodo dragon is a prime example of this ancient lineage. One such living legend is the Komodo dragon, a creature that has fascinated scientists and nature enthusiasts alike for decades. The Komodo dragon is the largest lizard on Earth, growing up to 10 feet in length and weighing over 150 pounds. Found only in the Indonesian archipelago, these magnificent reptiles inhabit a handful of volcanic islands, each with its own unique ecosystem. These islands, with their rugged terrain and sparse vegetation, provide the perfect backdrop for the Komodo dragon's reign. The Komodo dragon reigns as the apex predator in Komodo National Park, a sanctuary that protects these incredible creatures. Their isolation on these islands has allowed them to evolve into formidable creatures, largely unchallenged by other large carnivores. This lack of competition has enabled the Komodo dragon to become a dominant force in its environment, a true testament to its evolutionary success. The Komodo dragon embodies a primal fear and represents an incredible story of evolutionary success with its powerful build and fearsome reputation. Understanding these creatures offers invaluable insights into the processes that have shaped life on our planet, from their hunting strategies to their social behaviours. To witness a Komodo dragon in its natural habitat is an experience unlike any other, a rare glimpse into a world where ancient and modern collide. Their slow, deliberate movements can be deceptive as they are capable of surprising bursts of speed and agility when hunting or threatened. These sudden bursts of speed make them formidable hunters able to take down prey much larger than themselves. Their story is one of power, resilience and adaptation marked by the scars and battles they endure in the wild. The Komodo dragon's continued survival is a call for urgent conservation efforts, ensuring that future generations can marvel at this ancient giant. The habitat of the Komodo dragon is a dramatic landscape shaped by volcanic activity and the relentless tropical sun. These Indonesian islands feature sweeping arid savannas and pockets of tropical monsoon forest. The open grasslands are crucial for basking and hunting, while the forests offer nesting sites and cover. Coastal areas with mangrove thickets and sandy beaches provide additional resources. Komodo dragons are capable swimmers and have been observed moving between nearby islands. The climate is distinctly seasonal, with a long, dry season followed by a shorter, intense, wet season. The dragons must adapt to these fluctuating conditions, conserving energy and making the most of hunting opportunities. Their resilience in such a demanding environment is truly remarkable. The physical characteristics of the Komodo dragon are formidable, perfectly honed for its role as an apex predator. Adult males can reach up to 3 meters and weigh over 70 kilograms. Their bodies are powerfully built, covered in tough osteoderm-reinforced scales. A Komodo dragon's head is a fearsome weapon, with powerful jaws lined with razor-sharp, serrated teeth. Venom glands in their lower jaw produce a complex cocktail of proteins that induce shock and prevent blood clotting. Their limbs are short but incredibly strong, equipped with long, sharp claws. One of the most distinctive features is their long yellow forked tongue, used to taste the air and detect prey from astonishing distances. This highly developed sense of smell is crucial for locating food in their often sparse environment. The Komodo dragon is an opportunistic carnivore with a varied diet. These formidable reptiles are known for their incredible adaptability when it comes to hunting and feeding. Young dragons feed on insects, geckos and bird eggs, often spending time in trees to avoid larger adults. This arboreal lifestyle helps them stay safe from predators, including their own kind. Adult Komodo dragons can take down formidable animals, including Timor deer, water buffalo and wild pigs. Their powerful limbs and sharp claws make them efficient hunters. They are primarily ambush predators lying in wait along game trails or near waterholes. This strategy allows them to surprise their prey with a sudden powerful attack. The initial bite might not be immediately fatal, but the venom and ensuing infection weaken the prey. The Komodo dragon's saliva contains a mix of bacteria and venom that ensures the prey's eventual demise. 
The dragon then tracks the injured animal, waiting for it to succumb to its wounds. This patient stalking can last for hours or even days, showcasing the dragon's relentless nature. Komodo dragons can consume up to 80% of their body weight in a single sitting. This incredible capacity allows them to go for long periods without needing another meal. They are not dainty eaters tearing at a carcass with great ferocity. Their powerful jaws and serrated teeth help them rip through flesh and bone with ease. This ability to gorge themselves allows them to sustain themselves for long periods between successful hunts. After a large meal, they can rest and digest for days, conserving energy for their next hunt. Komodo dragons are largely solitary creatures, preferring to roam their territories alone. These magnificent reptiles are often seen wandering through their habitats, each dragon maintaining its own space and avoiding others unless necessary. They are territorial and have a keen sense of their own domain, which they patrol regularly. They rely on the sun's warmth to regulate their body temperature, often basking in open areas to absorb the heat. This behavior is crucial for their survival as it helps them maintain the energy needed for hunting and other activities. Despite their solitary nature, they congregate around large carcasses where a distinct social hierarchy is observed. The largest and most dominant males typically eat first, asserting their status through displays of size and aggression. This pecking order ensures that the strongest individuals get the most nourishment, which is vital for their survival and reproductive success. The breeding season brings about more intense social interactions, with males competing for access to receptive females. These competitions can be fierce, involving physical combat and displays of strength. After mating, the female seeks out a suitable nesting site and lays a clutch of up to 30 eggs. She carefully selects and prepares the site to ensure the safety and development of her offspring. The young dragons are incredibly vulnerable and often take to the trees to avoid predators. They spend the first few years of their lives feeding on insects and small reptiles, staying out of reach of larger predators. This arboreal lifestyle is a crucial survival strategy during their early years. They spend the first few years of their lives feeding on insects and small reptiles. Once large enough, they descend to compete with adults on the ground, ready to establish their own territories and continue the cycle of life. The journey from vulnerable hatchling to dominant adult is a testament to the resilience and adaptability of the Komodo dragon. The world of the Komodo dragon is filled with astonishing details. Fossil evidence suggests their ancestors evolved in Australia around 50 million years ago. Komodo dragons can reproduce asexually through parthenogenesis, producing male offspring without mating. They can run in short bursts at speeds of up to 20 kilometers per hour. Young dragons are skilled climbers, using their sharp claws to ascend trees. They are also competent swimmers, capable of covering significant distances in water. The venom of the Komodo dragon contains toxins that cause a rapid drop in blood pressure and prevent blood from clotting. This sophisticated chemical weapon combined with their powerful bite makes them formidable hunters. The majestic Komodo dragon faces a precarious future, currently listed as endangered. Habitat loss and degradation, human encroachment and agricultural expansion reduce their available space and resources. The decline in their natural prey species and climate change present significant threats. Rising sea levels and changes in temperature and rainfall patterns could further impact their habitat. Conservation efforts, such as the establishment of Komodo National Park, are crucial for their protection. Dedicated teams of rangers and scientists work to monitor dragon populations and manage their habitat. Anti-poaching patrols protect both the dragons and their prey species. Raising awareness and responsible ecotourism can provide economic benefits and incentives for conservation. By working together, we can ensure that these ancient giants continue to roam their islands for generations to come.